Cheryl, this is your room. But you're not in it. You know, I think we're getting somewhere. We're all tied up in this marriage thing. Marriage worked a lot better when we didn't live so long. We have phrases like the honeymoon is over to remind us how quickly marriage is sour. You think I'm being cynical? Divorce does that to you. Come on, you think marriage can really last? Should a couple stay together for the kids? Do you think it's a bad idea to marry young? You think sex becomes stale after marriage? You know what? You being such an expert on marriage, you're going to ace my matchmaker test. On the table are six pictures. All you have to do is sort them into three married couples. All finished. Okay, now tell me which of those couples are still together. <laughs> I'm joking. You know I'm just trying to provoke you, right? Oh, let's keep going. We're really making progress here. Harry? Harry? Were you dreaming? Are you okay? What are you doing here? This place is... Your home, right? I saw the photos of you in the corridor, you and your family. Cheryl isn't here. I'm sorry. The woman said Cheryl was at the lighthouse. The lighthouse closed down years ago. Now I need to go there. John and I can drive you there. We'll take the lake road. Thank you. So you're Harry. John. Well, don't mind me. I'm sure you two have lots of catching up to do. John, don't be silly. Nice car you got, John. I always wanted one of these. But when Cheryl was born, we graduated to the family car club. Trunk space wins out over engine size. I'd swap the car for a family any day. Though I'm happy enough with just John for now. Cut it out, Michelle. Huh? It's embarrassing. Uh, I'm not embarrassed. Don't mind me. This isn't how I wanted things to go. It's not Harry's fault. I Nothing mean... Nothing to do with Harry. I mean this. Us. I wanted to make things clear. I wanted to do things right. What are you saying? This reunion. This weekend. I wanted to come see you to talk things through. Talk? About our relationship? Michelle, there is no relationship. Please, don't do this. Not now, Joe. If not now, when? Where? Christ, Michelle, I've been trying to do this for months, but you don't want to hear it. Now we have a witness. Maybe you'll listen. You're just tired. You're not thinking right. It's been too long since we've been together. No. No, Michelle. I was hoping to do this right, but I need to do it. We've been running on empty for a long time. Living on fumes. It isn't a relationship, it's a courtesy. If I still love you, it can't be over. It is! 
You don't love me. You love the John in your head. Please. I can't listen to this. I can't do this anymore. 